That is. How may we help you, ma'am? Well, gentlemen, a very expensive piece of jewelry was stolen from my home today. A necklace worth over $150,000. Well, you've come to the right place, Mrs. Boots. Me and my associate will have to investigate your home tomorrow. Can we stop by? I would really appreciate it, but the only problem is I'll be out all day. Can I give you guys a spare key? That way you'll have all the time you need. That'll do just fine. We'll have a full report for you by sundown tomorrow. Thank you. If I don't get that necklace back, I will need a report to give to the insurance company. Good luck, gentlemen. Thanks. There you go. Let's not screw this up, Wendelaga. We haven't solved the case in... I don't even know how long. I promise you brought back. This time I'll take the job seriously. I even brought my lucky glasses. Why don't you just go keep searching for clues? Go check the basement. There's an entrance down there. The thief might have came that way. Found, These cells are full of blueprints. I think it's about time trouble. Come here. I always have to babysit you. Come on, stop looking at this shit. Look at this cock. I mean clock. I wonder what sound it makes. <laughs> Back in time. Okay. 
You know what, I need to get another partner that's not insane. How about that? You know what, let's just go. Come on, let's get some coffee and let's write this report. Hey, isn't that Mrs. Boots? I think you're right, Wintelaga. I think you're right. Did you finish my police report? Well, we found out who stole your necklace. Oh, really? Who? It was you! Mrs. Boots, you're under arrest for falsely claiming that your necklace was stolen, as well as insurance fraud. How did you know it was me? Well, that's for us to know. For you, well, <laughs> that's for us to know. What the hell did you just do? Uh, all I did was run to Kako! I think we went back in time! You fucking...